we are going to uh, fly to Narita, Tokyo. First time. This guy many times. Uh, yeah, don't know what to expect. Oh, watch the episode of Anthony Bourdain yesterday about. Uh, Which one? Anthony Bourdain. Anthony Bourdain. Holy fuck. Who's that? You don't know who Anthony Bourdain is? Who's it? It's that famous uh, food critic. I feel like I've heard of it. Oh, okay. I think I know who it is. The white guy? Yeah, old, white hair. And that passed away a couple years ago. Oh, he died? Yeah. Oh, see, I, I, I don't keep up with the network stuff anymore. Yeah, but he, he made a documentary or an episode about um, Japanese culture. Why? About um, the weirdness and the cultural shock of. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm not sure he's Western. So. Of uh, it, it, my cultural shock. I'm gonna be cultural. <coughs> really? I love that. This is a weird shit. Well, um, weird, wild stuff. The first thing I tell people if they're going to Japan, yeah, the first culture shock you're gonna encounter is that you're gonna have to go the opposite way. Oh, yeah, that's right. You walk on the left, not the right. That's my first day at the end piece of information to tell people to uh, we're going to be walking on the island. When you cross the street, you look right here, you're going to be used to the US. Here's the view, got a window seat. Okay, so this is the uh, United Premium Plus seats. Um, let's see what they have. Alright, so a mini bag, uh, we got a pillow, a blanket, some headphones, slippers. Um, this is the tray table with a little extender right here. Slides into the armrest. Boom. We got the remote control here, the recline options, and right here oh, is the little so, entertainment screen. That is very stiff to use, um, but yeah, there's that. Twenty L. Um, and it comes with a little amenity bag. My way. Um, let's open it. Open this up. Whoop. Thank you, Philip. We broke the seal. We broke the seal. We got some lip balm. Can I bright? Can I bright? Alright, we got some lip balm. Uh, people coughing. Uh, what is this? Um, oh, hand cream. There you go. Hand cream. Uh, a sleeping mask. Very cool, very cool. Some air plugs, air plugs. Some socks. Some socks, but don't go barefoot on a plane. It's gross. Oh, and uh, toothbrush. And yeah, that's about it. And a discount code for this, this brand. Oh, no. But they're good, bad, whatever. Um, <laughs> It's good. It's good. Breakfast time, we're 
leaving in about an hour and a half. Um, well, this looks a lot better than uh, lunch, I guess, dinner. Um, egg, white bites, or potatoes, tomatoes, potatoes, tomatoes, sausages, a little fruit salad, a nice warm croissant. Um, jam, butter, utensils. And yeah, it looks pretty good. Way better than yeah, my first. So uh, let's give it a try. made it to the airbnb i think hotel apartment thing our apartment um <laughs> so we had to do a three hour train ride from narita airport to i don't know where we're at honestly like somewhere in tokyo um this is our little setup like we have a bunk bed right two sinks but i'm guessing one sink is serves a different purpose than the other sink induction stove top i guess you can hand wash your clothes and air dry it in this usually you can do both spiral air dry and we have a little tv ac which we probably won't need because it's freaking cold um a mini fridge vacuum cleaner and Toaster oven and the microwave? But I think they serve us both. Anyways, um, here's our little bathroom. Super tiny. Seems like every Japanese place I've been to so far has a bidet. 
if you don't know what a bidet is, it basically cleans your behind for you, so you save toilet paper, I guess. And a teeny shower, which is making water at the moment, but yeah. Um, yeah, that's what we got. And I'll, I'll guess a little, a little closet. closet. Another vacuum. Oh, another. Oh, yeah, this is a um, more blankets if it gets cold. And I guess this is the. Oh, the intercom. Yeah, the intercom. But I don't think anyone's gonna visit us, so we, I guess. But okay. So the outside of this place looks sketchy as fuck. Okay. It looks like plastic walling, like plastic roofing like this like freaking um screwed on to um pillars foundation and just kind of like screwed it on and they called it a day right so on the outside looks kind of sketchy looks kind of creepy honestly but uh but yeah it's cool i mean we have little curtains there you know you know yeah so you did bring your gopro what the fuck i did bring it Okay, oh, so have you ever seen one of these before? Yes, yeah, a damn vending machine. Yeah, have you known that there's a hot drinks in there too? I've seen vlogs of hot drinks in vending machines, but I will try them myself soon enough. And now we found a little, um, I don't know, steak, bok, bok, bok soup, bronco, bronco. Oh, sorry, bronco. Um, the steaks spot, like ten minute walk away. So we're gonna get some. Uh, it's not even late night. It's only like what seven, seven thirty. Yeah. Ish. Yeah, so dinner time. So like I said at first, we had a long day of travel, a good a good 14, 15 hours. Surprisingly, cars everywhere. Uh, surprisingly, I'm not that tired, but freaking starving. And uh, it is raining right now. Right. Mm -hmm. So I didn't bring an umbrella. So Mr. Big Ass Eagle over here thought that he could get into Tokyo without bringing an umbrella. No, no, I got into Tokyo without bringing an umbrella. What are you talking about? Anyway, this fool... I, I, I got in. Got it under my umbrella. Ella AAA. Because he doesn't want to have a fucking umbrella with him. It's only, it's only raining for one day. Shut up. Not even a day. A We're from San Francisco. You rain any damn time. A couple hours. Oh my god. Technically. And we're not going too far tonight. I don't think so, at least. <laughs> uh, so, we're gonna eat steak or meat. Um, and then, see if there's like izakaya nearby. So, izakaya is like a little like skewer, uh, skewer beer shop, I guess. It's, I don't a, know. it's like a pub. A pub ish, Japanese pub sort <clears throat> type thing. Yeah. So, we're gonna go to that after we eat. So we can eat again, and then go into some convenience store to buy more food, and then maybe eat again. So we're gonna do that, and when we get back, we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do tomorrow, and the day after, and the day after that, because we have no plans. Well, we have plans, just not just organized. not organized plans. <laughs> and also, there are vending machines all over the freaking place. Freaking crazy. <laughs> it's like around every like fucking street corner there's a vending machine. And apparently they sell hot drinks in a freaking vending machine. Oh there's an onsen here bro. And there's onsen, yeah he just found out. Let's go this way. Um there's an onsen here. I'm gonna drop you off. What? <laughs> there's an onsen like one of these places here. Okay, yeah, we'll join it. And he wants to go to Nonsen, so we'll do that too. So we're getting our steaks. Boom, got some corn cheese corn. Mm. <laughs> We're gonna walk out with like strong ass garlic bread. 
俺と約10分でしょ。ましたうん。もう支払いしてる分も全然出るからね。でかくステークサースキューリーは。ああ、でかいね。で、10個いってるんですよ、支払い。Um, this guy had just got a warm coffee. It's a little too hot for me to handle right now. Yeah, I'm gonna get a milk tea. It's a f uh, right now. Let's see. <clears throat> 110. We're gonna go、uh, rich milk tea. And your chain comes up. More coins. <laughs> a lot of coins that I don't know what I'm gonna deal with. Hella coins. And then you grab your drink right here. That was a pull, guys, not push. My bad. Oh man, this is warm. Is it really? Oh yeah. It's a warm milk tea. Alright, let's try this right now. Whoa, look at this steam. You see the steam coming out? Oh, yeah, I see it actually. It's pretty. Oh, fuck, how are you going? Oh, it is legit. 